Welcome back, Normans, as we try to establish ourselves as the Emperors of Rome. There isn't a rebellion, and we are doing a good job of stomping out their numbers nice and early. I'm over overwhelmed by stress. Ah. Irritable or reclusive, I don't want either. We'll continue with the stress. Stress isn't that bad. How is our stress doing now? We are at level... Uh, well, we're at two out of three. And we're pretty close to going further. Is there any way I can lower stress at all here? I can attempt suicide. That would <laughs> definitely get rid of my stress. But no, that's, that's not what we're about here. We're about just destroying our rebels underfoot. Ah! 37% charm. Let's try it. We'll try again then. Okay, how do we win this war? Do I just go with white peace, perhaps? If I enforce the march, they become imprisoned. I, they do become imprisoned, which means I can force them to change religion. Which I very much would like to do. If I force them to change religion, that's going to be very strong. Let's wait for him to be locked in there, if he will. No, he's just going to keep dodging it. Well, let's go and get some siege progress then. Ah, Duke uh, Edrimbos has died. That's one of my... That was one of the guys I was after. Does that mean all of his children get... <sighs> I was hoping to get rid of his claim before his children existed as people uh, with a position. Um, You're pretty fucking useless, but take it. Oh, no, we're up to ten again. He had a lot of children. Am I already trying to abduct you? No, and you're very strong. You, though. Abduct? 10%. Ah. Maybe I have to wait until the uh, war is at 56. No, we'll start that. Then I have to get out of war again. Ay, ay, ay. 68. We'll give that a crack. And it worked. Excellent. Well, your child will not be getting a claim. Thank you. Now, get out of here. Oh, is he no longer in the war? No, um, he's not in the war anymore. He is imprisoned by me. Oh, we can ask you to convert, or we can ask you for money. Ransom, 100 gold. I do like the money. But then you converting would be fun as well. Negotiate release. Demand conversion. Renounce claims, gain weak hook. Weak hook and conversion would be nice. Although banishment is banished from the realm. His heir is this guy, so his, this guy would take over. So let's not banish him. Let's just uh, gain weak hook. Good. 10,000 men, strong army. What do we do? I think we do want 100%. My friends here are doing a grand job about it. I can go and siege over this way. That'll get us some war score. Another council member. Chancellor. Assign. Uh, it's only a bit better. Yeah, we'll assign you. And for all you are married to my daughter, aren't you? Yeah, we'll return later and find out. Probably nothing uh, useful. Ah, excellent. A mischievous smile is playing on Duke Callistos' lips. I know you have acted strangely as of late, and for that I apologise. But I had good reason. Castellos hands me a neatly wrapped gift decorated with colourful ribbons. I wanted to surprise you. It had... I had it custom made. There's only one like it. Go ahead and open it. He hates me. Why would he do this? It's probably poison. Okay, I should be trying to abduct more claims as well. Currently, we're only going for abduct, abduct Mafeos. Abduct Mafeos. He's got all these children now of claims. Oh no. Abduct 49. Although you, I could simply kill. And it is more likely as well. Yes, children we can kill. His children don't have heirs who are going to take their claim. So yeah, we'll, we'll kill the children. Actually, my friends are doing well in their war over there.
A papal envoy has reached my court, bringing news from the Vatican. Pope Victor issued a call to arms to all righteous Christian rulers. As a Catholic emperor, I am expected to prepare my men in support of this most holy cause, sponsored by the Universal Church itself. To all those who will take the fight against the vile infidels descending upon the Holy Grounds of Jerusalem, the Holy See promises full absolution from all sins and guaranteed place in heaven. Uh, I can uh, finance it. I will say that I will join. 58%. Uh, no benefactuary. Well, a point. Where my, my half-brother? I like him. He's still alive, isn't he? Isn't he? No. Roger died. Roger's son is Hamlin. Can maybe give it to his son instead if Hamlin's here. No? Well... Uh... What about Robert's here with the pointy chin? He is uh, my cousin's child. Yeah, Robert's Mr. Pointy Chin. The Sicilian? No, he's Sicilian. Norman. It must be Norman. Serlo. Yeah, sure, Serlo. Select beneficiary. Uh, I here do have my own concerns trying to win this war. My friends are doing a good job. Oh, wait. They just want it for me. Excellent. Enforce demands. Everybody will be imprisoned. We'll disband our army. We need to get some money back. Let's have a look at who is in court. However, Duke, this guy, he does not have any claims on anything we want. He is Orthodox, so we could negotiate. Oh, I wish I could take their lands. 600 away. It's it's quite a while. I need a thousand. Prestige. Alright, well, let's sort them out anyway. I could convert them. Negotiate release. Demand conversion. And gain a weak hook. I could ask him to pay for the hook. Count Leonis. Negotiate release. Demand conversion. And gain a weak hook. Duke this guy. Negotiate release. Demand conversion. Gain a weak hook. This guy is just... This guy will negotiate release for conversion and recruitment, actually. Duke Leon. Negotiate release for conversion and weak hook. Mayor Timofos. Negotiate release for money. Now I'll just take your 30 gold straight. This mayor here. Mayors, I, I will just take the money from, yes. Manuel. Negotiate release for conversion. Sure. Okay, well, we're going to gain a little bit of money through all of these uh, demands. He'll give me 50 gold, him, there. It's half as much as I would get, but I am converting them. Farewell, farewell. Farewell, farewell. Farewell. And farewell. Now let's rake in that money. Give me your money. Shame it's not more, actually. But I'll still take the, uh, the bit there. Now give me out of debts relatively fast, actually. So you there, you are at 85 and 89. Very good. We will have them both gone. No doubt about. Perfect time. You will renounce your claims. But not give me a weak hook, unfortunately. Very good. Well, let's just keep up with our task here of getting rid of all the claimants, really. And we're currently working on one of the daughters to kill. Can we kill you as well? Yeah, uh, we'll just kill people without children. It's it's not really that uh, much of an issue. They won't take long at all. We'll be out of uh, debt soon. We'll be able to save up money for potential bribes. Although I would like the rest of those archers. They would be... Oh, I'm dead. That's a shame. That's a real shame because I was very close to wiping out everybody. Huh. Natural causes at 54. Emperor Bohemond of the Byzantine Empire has found peace in Christ's embrace at 54 years of age. He died of natural causes. A known murderer, he will atone for his unspeakable crimes in the next life. Emperor Bertrand ascends to the throne. Having mastered many skills, he is sure to be admired by his subjects. Oh, I'm sure I will be. Let's have a look here. We will get rid of that hat. We don't need that. We'll go to actually default on both. Yeah, it's much better. Cloak. Yes, we have a cloak. We'll take that. My children are now claimants. Let's have a look, though, and see exactly who is a claimant. 
Mostly de Hauntervilles. So we got that going for us. No lifestyle chosen. Well, we are in intrigue. And we have got Kidnapper, you genius of a man. I'm so glad. We'll take um, Agent again. I think I will. I think I'll take Agent Acceptance. And we do need A per cancel positions. You are not the best at intrigue, my wife. I'll have you go for the domain that might be able to help us here. As for a Chancellor, I'll take somebody who's good at their job. Steward, somebody who's good at their job, please. Oh, you actually did convert the faith. Well, let's continue trying to convert the faith around here. You promoted the culture. Good. Let's keep up with that. The Marshal, I will assign whoever's best. And Spy Master. I want somebody good who also is decently trusted. I'll take you. You can be trusted. You all accept that. You won't convert. You might do. We'll ask. Anyway, the, um, the area here is being converted. Slowly but surely. Excellent. I'm very happy with how that went. As far as convergence go. Um, let's see how well I am actually at um, kidnapping though, or killing. Let's go to his his um, children here. Murder. 88% chance. I will take it. I will uh, go through these murders still. Oh, I can actually only do one at a time. <sighs> Soon, I'm sure we will fix that and be able to do multiple. But no, at least I can still go through these murders. And my son has come of age. Well, ensure that he is forbidden from fighting on the front lines, though. We don't need that. He's at level 7, so he's down a bit. But still, it's good to make sure that my son and heir is forbidden. Not the best at intrigue, but he's alright. Trove can marry. That is my son and heir to this lady here. She is the sibling of this man. So we will send the proposal. Which means I would like to negotiate alliance with you. Uh, let's get back to wherever it was. And with you... Thank you. Do I have any other alliances? I don't. Can I negotiate with you guys again? I can there. Can I with France? No, only request a claim. What about Poland? No, Hungary? No. Holy Roman Empire, though, I can negotiate an alliance with, and so I shall. Let's see about my son. So you're there. You are not troved off. Let's see what I can do. Alliance power. There is France. I will uh, once again ally France. As for you, though, let's see about one of our powerful vassals around here. Not Thracia. Um, somebody like Achaea? They're not that strong. We do have a daughter here. Arrange a marriage to my younger son here. Yeah, I'll take I'll take that line. Fast and inferior, but I'll take it. Children like guardians will uh, give you my son to me. And my daughter, Constance, will give to, uh, well, to me again. Why not? Oh, very good. Very good. I'm happy with how all that went. I am a bit low on the money, though. Why? Oh, I have too many lands, of course. Uh, let's cancel that, and let's give away something, then, I suppose. Um, I do have all of these over here. There's you, uh, 0 0.20... 1.1, 0 0.1, 0 0.1. Not really great. Rosanio, I could give to my younger son. I do have a dukedom around here. Do I have the dukedom of here, actually? Actually, I, don't, I wouldn't want to lose you, as you're... as you are a pretty good guy there. Um, let's see what duchies I could give away. Yeah, Duchy of Calabria might be the one to go with. Let's give him that. Grand titles. Duchy of Calabria. I'll simply make you a one-county duke. Not very strong, but still we will make you a lord, and I will get my finances back in order. Very good. Spouse, or stay here with me instead. I can lay with my wife. I don't really need to, but we'll do it anyway. We will lay with our wife. Very good. She's insane. My insane wife. She's German. Or Franconian. German. Yes. Uh, God let him know his place. Well done, my boy. Well done, boy. Money is really uh, coming in. I don't need to bribe anyone with these things, so I am going to hire up a couple hundred extra bowmen. I want to get up to the 500. 
And the Crusade for Jerusalem has launched. Deus Vault. Am I a part of it? I am. So I'm now at war with you. We have 35,000 people. He has 18,000. Okay. Okay, not bad. Not bad. And in this crusade, my benefactor is Serlo. Do I have anybody better, close, more closely related? My sister? My sister is betrothed off to this man here, but I could... Oh, she already has children. Who are the Hauntervilles. Ah. But no, there is spiky chin. <laughs> uh, I have my other sister. She is betrothed. We could replace that. Matilda. Have her be a queen now. My sister. I will select you as beneficiary. This guy, he's not really worth it. We'll break that betrothal. And my sister will find her another one matrilineally. We'll sort by lines power in our own area, though. And Tiong. Navara, Bandit, nobody's really uh, sticking out to me here. So let's just sort by, I don't know, prestige gain perhaps. Anybody relatively older? 15 year olds? Basque? Russian? I should go with uh, somebody in my own realm. Let's sort by that if I can. I don't know if I can. Marriage? Alliances? No alliances? No. Alliance power? I would like somebody in my own realm, really. In Greek, but I can't sort by my own culture. No one a bit younger are these kind of chaps. Well, let's go with this guy then. Matrilineal. I'm sure she'll be a grand queen if she were to take the position. Assassin. Do it. Excellent. So she's dead. <laughs> she was married to a uh, crusader there. Let's have a look and uh, pick another target though. Collect ten claimants still. Ay, ay, ay. Start with the other adult one, because they all... Oh, I was going to say they do have the option of creating more... Uh, as their abduction, not so likely murder, very likely. But then we got to do her heir as well. So we'll try with the... Um, we'll try with the abduction. And we'll hope that that goes through, because then her child won't have to be worried about. There are people who could be in oh well, well yes, let's let's not worry about that then we can get all the way up there. I'll let these guys start their war first though. The Kingdom of Jerusalem, it's all the way down here. I don't think I have I do have some of it. Okay, well let's let the other crusaders go and do a bit of their handiwork at first, then maybe I'll roll in. Because these are a lot of forces for me to try and fight. No, let, let's get in there. This crusade belongs to us. Call up all of our forces. Get them all over here ready. Everybody ready? Yeah, they're all ready. Let's go in here and have a bit of a fight, shall we? Thirteen thousand? Don't mind if I do. Off to war we go. We will win this crusade. Uh, now we fight this force. I'm not sh quite sure what was going on there. But still, my uh, daughter has come of age. She's betrothed off to a capet. Good for her. Growing up very fast. But we want to uh, siege out all of this land. Yes, we do. Let's get to it. We want to siege Jerusalem so we get our war participation. Abduction underway, perfect time. Let, let, let's strike. No? No, yeah, try it again. Um, so where else is in Jerusalem there? You are. Okay, well I want to go and seize that then. I want this war score to go to me. Does it show who is the biggest participant? No, it will here, won't it? War score... Your war contribution, 86%. Excellent. Yeah, well that's exactly what we want. Our sieges go through fast as well. They do have a bit of an army coming in, but there are reinforcements around. Come on, guys. Come help us. You're going the wrong way. Wrong way, everybody. 
Hey everyone! Run away! Why? Come on! Really? Oh, now you turn back. Well, ah, oh, Tustin, yeah, I, I doubt she's that name. Great. Yeah, we lost a fair few guys, but we do still have our war contribution up at first. Let these chaps suffer a bit, eh? They somewhat deserve it. In fact, let's let's cancel our army for a bit. Let them go do some gallivanting around. We'll uh, come back later with a full stack. Valeria, so we are still plotting against you. Good. It's a shame I can't do two. That's quite a while away as well. Anyway, that'll do for this episode. Thank you for watching. Hopefully the Crusaders here will lower the enemy numbers enough so that I can just come in and have all the war contribution. I'll see you guys then. Thank you again for watching. I do greatly appreciate it. Goodbye.